The purpose of this video is to discuss the ripping in IPv6. Ripping is quite different configuring wise from RIP version 1 and RIP version 2, though all the RIP concepts are still the same. For example, our metric is hop count, maximum 15 hops, but the multicast address in ripping is FF02 double colon 9 instead of 224.0.0.9 as it was in IP version 4. Now let us configure ripping routing. First command on router 1 is IPv6 unicast routing for enable IPv6 routing which is to be configured on all the routers IPv6 unicast routing and on router 3 also IPv6 unicast routing now moving to the configuration of RIP so we will start from router 1 Moving to configuration mode, IPv6 router rip and then the name for identifying this process. So we will give ripping, then we have to enable rip on our interface and as well as on our loopback. So interface serial 0 slash 0 IPv6 rip and then the name ripping enable so our rip is enabled on serial interface 0 slash 0 of router 1 then on the interface loopback one IPv6 rip then the name ripping and enable and exit now our rip is enabled on router 1 now moving to router 2 first we will give IPv6 router rip and then the name ripping then we have to enable it on the interface so interface is 0 slash 0 ipv6 router rip and then the name ripping and then enable and enter then we have to enable on it serial interface 0 slash 1 so interface 0 slash 1 ipv6 rip then the name ripping and then enable and then on the interface loop back 1 IPv6 rip ripping the name and enable so now our rip is enabled on router 2 now moving to router 3 so first command is IPv6 router rip and then the name so name is ripping then we have to enable it on the interface serial 0 slash 0 so ip v6 rip then ripping and enable and then on its loopback also so interface loopback 1 ip v6 rip then the name ripping and enable so now a rip is enabled on all the routers router 1 router 2 and as well as on the router 3 so now if we verify our routes by show ipv6 
route command on router 1 it will show us that all the routes are coming in the routing table and these are the routes which are learned through dip which are having are denoted by r this is, the, this is the loopback route of router 2 this is the loopback route of router 3 and this is the network 23 double colon and 64 which is also learned by rip so if we ping 23 double colon 3 that is our router 3 we will get a reply so it means that our ripping is enabled on all the routers and it is working properly so this is how rip is configured in ipv6 thank you